a sense of humor. Jay Mansell said, the great man is he who does not lose his child's heart. And what is a child's heart? Child's heart is pure and full of joy and laughter and humor. Dr. William Fry, medical doctor, MD and uh, professor of psychiatry reported that a kindergarten student, a KG student laughs about 300 times a day on an average and an adult on an average laughs only about 19 times. Why such a big gap? What's wrong? Have we become too, too uptight? Have we become too tense? Have we forgotten to laugh? Okay. Or are we taking life too seriously? Is it not time that we learn to relax? We learn to laugh? Okay. We are more apt to have a sense of humor when we are ourselves, when we are natural, when we are not pretentious or pompous, not trying to score victories over others or projecting our personality in front of others just to, uh, to cover up our feelings of insecurity. Humor, humor is there for the asking for anybody who is willing to let go of his tension who's, and who refuses to take himself too seriously. A sense of humor is a gift that you give to yourself all the year round. A man without a sense of humor is like a wagon without springs. It will be jolted by every, ro uh, by every stone, by every pebble on the road. Nature has given us five senses to lead an ideal life. Obviously, that those five senses are not enough. We need a sixth sense, the sense of humor. Okay. A sense of humor, and what is sense of humor? It's not, sense of humor is not merely telling jokes or laughing at jokes. Sense of humor is an attitude towards life. It's the picture that you take of life. It is how you respond to life situations. It's the ability to, to laugh at your mistakes and your stupidities, to laugh at the uh, frailties and foibles of human nature. Okay? And it is an attitude which teaches you, which tells you that take your work, take your profession, take your commitments, take your relationship seriously, but don't take life seriously. In any case, you are not likely to get out of it alive. Okay. The Greek philosopher Plato said that even the gods love humor and jokes. This must be correct because all uh, spiritual scriptures record their, uh, that uh, the value of record the value of humor of laughter. Okay. To quote only one example, the great prophet of Islam, Prophet Muhammad is reported to have said, he deserves paradise who makes his companions laugh. Who makes his companions laugh. J. Mendes says, whoever makes you laugh helps you to live. And the same thought was echoed by Lincoln when he said, I would have succumbed under the pressures of office if I did not have a sense of humor. There are lots of benefits of having a sense of humor. We will mention only a few. Sense of humor is a safety valve which keeps you sane and relaxed. It gives you a sense of hope and it enlivens you. Sense of humor is one of the greatest assets that a successful uh, person uh, can possess, a happy a successful pos person possesses. When a number of senior managers were asked, uh, when a number of senior managers were asked what they consider the most important asset uh, and uh, which they use for selection, more than 80% said a sense of humor. Similarly, in a male partners wanted ad, more than 80% women said that they would prefer a man with a sense of humor. Uh, humor reduces uh, your pain. It, it releases endorphins which reduce your pain. Humor gives you, uh, it makes you immune to diseases. And humor helps you to develop a, a state of mind which accepts what cannot be changed and which changes what can be changed. And humor makes you very popular, makes you productive and in increases your joy of life. To develop your own sense of humor, read humorous books, meet, be with people who are joyful and joyous and positive, avoid negative people, avoid negative words, okay? And learn to be relaxed, learn to be light. As G.K. Chesterton said, angels fly high because they are light. So can you.